Hi everyone, it's Catherine or Mrs. Cronall and I'm here today with the first of my Essence videos for this week. I will be doing a normal liquored and lacquered on Tuesday so that won't be there won't be an Essence video on Tuesday but there will every other day and just for this video I'll show you what's on my nails. We have OPI's Fearlessly Alice beautiful blue. A lot of people find that stains. I haven't found that but I keep away from my cuticles. Um, and we have Moshin which is uh, this beautiful bar glitter topper from Zoya. So that is what's on my nails. I won't announce it for every video. It'll be in the description box as usual. So yeah I have uh, three polishes to show you today so it's really really short and sweet and they're all kind of similar color family, pinky kind of red colors. So we're gonna start with the lightest color. Sorry about the banging. The reason I picked these up was um, they were reduced in um, the shop that I was in, which is often a sign with Essence that they are going to discontinue the color. So um, yeah, I thought I'd pick them up. This one is number 89 and it's called High Pink Panther. I love the name. It isn't to my eye what a pink panther pink would be. Um, I have already pre, uh, I, I kind of already swatched them on swatch sticks so I know that they're very good formulas and I know that I don't need to come back and do a second coat or anything like that because they're so good and this is high pink panther. Let's adjust our lighting here so you can see that. So there it is just this beautiful shiny creamy pink very very pretty it is almost like a bubblegum pink and um yeah just that great great formula from essence and just for a point of comparison just in case you're wondering it is incredibly uh, different to be awesome tonight which is number 55 which is way lighter and yeah so they're very very different it is also very different to the Peachier Flamingo. So that is High Pink Panther. The next lightest is this very coral colour. It's a really, really pretty colour. I don't know why. I've recommended this to somebody and I have never picked it up myself. I don't know why. Maybe I, I just kept thinking I had it. This is called Vava Voom and it's number 47 and it is a soft matte. It kind of has a satin finish. So hopefully we'll see that pretty quickly. So it goes on just like, oops, did that off camera. Uh, it goes on just very um, creamy. I'm sorry, I caught something there, so I got a little bit distracted with my brush stroke. So we will hold on to see if that dries down a little bit more matte for you. Still pretty shiny, we'll come back to that in a second. While we're waiting that to dry down, let me just show you the other kind of corally color, red color in my collection from Essence. It's one of my favorites and it is hot red chili. They are close in the camera, but um, the soft matte Vava Voom is way more orange and this newer color is much more red color. So yeah, I would say that this one is more of a true, is more of a true um, coral. And uh, yeah, the thing I like about the essence is you always know when the cap is not fully secure. So, it's starting to lose that shine there a little bit. I'll come back to it at the very end and we can see has it mattified for us. And the last one I have to show you today is number 77. This is Dreaming of Love. Really, really kind of mauvey pink color. And I haven't looked through my trends collections or anything like that to see if I have colors like this. I've just looked at the gel line and I don't think I have a color like this. Um, this is this is way more pinky than it is mauve, I should say, when you swatch it. Really, really pretty. Very opaque on the first coat. And just to compare it to the one that I thought it would be closest to, yeah, this one is way more of a kind of a, 
a browner pink this is number 48 my love diary so yeah they are very different this is way more pink in tone so uh, let's have a look at this all of those again we had high pink panther so that's it there again it's going to depend on your application whether you want uh, one to two coats with the gel line polishes it really really depends on the polish and on the length of your nails and all that kind of thing then we had the soft matte which has mattified for us so you can just see it kind of gives a dull effect it's not a, a chalky matte at all and that was number 47 Vava Voom. Really, really nice. And then finally, the one I thought actually, it's just a really great work polish, isn't it? Just a really good standard kind of pink polish and that's dreaming of love so guys and girls they are the least interesting in terms of finishes for this week and um, the rest of this week everything is brand new but i thought i'd show you these just in case they are discontinuing the colors and you want to pick them up and um if you are also looking at the color boost line check to see if they've got the yellow the coral um, I believe it's the mid-toned pink as well. Uh, it seems as though they've removed a few of the more summery kind of uh, color boost colors. So if you've been holding off getting them, you might want to get those brighter colors now because they've definitely been removed from the stand um, in stores in 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 some of the stores here. So um, they, I think they've been made. They're making room for the hollows. So which you will see this week. You'll see all those hollow collect the new hollow collection this week too. So yeah, just if you're interested, if you've been holding off buying the color boost, you might want to go and get the ones you've been waiting for. All right, guys and girls, I will see you tomorrow for um. What will I see you tomorrow for? Liquor and lacquered. Yes. Okay. See you then, guys. Take care.